かな。And welcome to Sugary Bay Cove. Yes, in Dartmouth, just by Dartmouth Castle. We thought we'd uh, do a new location for you each time, and we've decided to come out for a walk. It's actually stopped raining, which is a, a change, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's only June. Yeah. <laughs> so here we are. What are we going to do today? Well, today we've got a double whammy for oh. you, haven't we? I've no idea what that means, I've just made it up. But what we're going to do is part one and part two special today because I've got a little bit of extra footage which we want to do, or a little bit of extra filming, haven't we? Yeah, yes. Um, so we'd already promised you that we were going to do our top five favourite sites in the UK, being the Southwest. So we're going to go and do that in another location. Prowl. Prawl. East Prawl. East Prawl. There's a pub there as well. Picking something. Pig and whistle? Something like that. So we'll do that bit there. First of all though, this is a special edition of what we've been up to. What have we uh, been up to? Route planning. Yes, we have been with our fellow souls route planning our journey down to... Um, Through France and yes. to Spain. Yes, we're going to call it the Grand Winter Tour. Yeah. So... I'm sure that's copyrighted somewhere but there we go. It's what? Grand Tour. Oh, is that where I've got it from? Yeah, You're watching that plumbing thing? Yeah. Yes, well anyway, this is our grand tour. So I've had to bring my notes here, because what we're going to do is introduce you to everybody, uh, tell you who they are. Obviously they're not here with us, so we can't do it. You can't see them visually. You will know some of the names. Now, first people coming with us are Pam and Perry, who joined us last year, along with Joe and Mark. We'll all be meeting up at Pool Harbour sometime around November the 20th to the 25th. We're not sure yet because, as you know, the winter book dates for the ferries don't come out until mid-July. So we don't know an exact date just yet, do we? No, not yet. So we've also got Donna and Stevo joining us. Now, they're already down in Spain at the moment, but they're going to come and join us in November as well. Um, who else we've got? Us. We'll us. be going. We'll be going, yeah. Um, Carl. Linda and Carl. No, I said Carl. Linda and Callum. Yes. Um, you will know them. They came and saw us last week. If you're on Facebook, you'll see all the photos. We've also hopefully got Top Hat and Phil going to come and join us sometime in Spain, aren't you? Mm. <laughs> and we may have another couple coming too, but we don't know just yet. But we will keep you informed of that. Now, what we thought we would do is let you know their towing rigs and what they've got. And what they will do, and if anyone is interested, they have all, we've all got different caravans and all different tow cars. So we thought we'd take some details as we drive along, and they've all agreed. Give you miles per gallon, any other questions you want to know. So, what I'm going to do is tell you, or Mark is, about their towing rigs, which we've got here. We have, yes. So, Carl's rig. He's got an Iveco daily van because he's pulling a hobby, what's it, 720, 720 UML. UML. So if you're interested in that, let us know and we'll write, write, do some recordings for you on our journey down. I just say that's a premium as well, isn't it? I don't know. Hobby premium, yeah. Okay, our rig, as you know, is a, I'll do this one, because I know. Go on then, you know Swift it. Swift Conqueror 645, towed with a Nissan Pathfinder. Pam and Perry. I've got a VW Passat car, the blue line, two liter which are diesel, and they're pulling a Swift, is it a Swift? No, that's their new one in Spain, but uh, they'll be pulling when we go down in a November. A Lunar Clubman. 400 stroke two. Yes. So an older style van, so again, if you want to know about what the older style vans do, then do let us know, we'll pass the information to Perry, and I'm sure he'll record it for you. They do have a newer van down in Spain, which they store there, but that's another story. It is. <laughs> okay, who else have we got? Donna and Steve-O. They've got a Swift Conqueror 480 and they're towing it with a BMW Model F15, I believe that is, yeah. which is, I think it's a 330 diesel. So again, if that interests you, you've got that, you want to know some uh, statistics, is that the right word? Results? Mm. Let us know and I'm sure Steve would love to let you know. Yes. And Mark and Joe. Right, they have got a VW Torag. 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 I should know, he's used to work with Volkswagen, VW. but there we are. 3 litre V6. Yeah. And he's towing a Coachman VIP 575. But 
he did have a, a, a Buccaneer Commodore, that's why he's got such a big tow car. But he decided that it was too heavy, too big, and too low. Yeah, we had a lot. He had a lot of trouble in Spain with the sights, with, because their chassis. They got, yeah, their chassis keep uh, crunching into things. Yes. Basically, it was a low slung chassis. Yeah, the and the motor mover was only a couple of inches off the floor, wasn't it? So they decided it was a bit too stressful, and they've upgraded and changed it, whatever you want to call it, to the coachman. The coachman. So again, we'll let you know if you've got a buccaneer. Maybe you have the same problems as well. Let us know. Um, so that is our grand winter tour soul, fellow souls yes. that are coming with us. Um, you know, I hope you come along. We will record everything and anything we can. The journey down, again, if you've got any questions that you want to know, all through winter, we'll be vlogging, so do pop them down. Um, and that's about it. It took us all day, didn't it? To yeah, revise. we did. We did go through the Axi book basically and did a route because there's a couple of places you want to visit in France this year. We're going to go through France and stay off its sites. We're not going to stay at the motorway airs. No. Um, so basically, everyone wants to stay at sites on the way down. Um, there's um, what's it? The the uh, village you want to see? Oh, Orador sur Glen. Sur Glen, which yeah. is a deserted village by there's Limoges. Limoges, Limoges, Limoges okay. as I call it. Yeah, Limoges. Yeah. Um, we thought this year we'd do a bit more sightseeing. Um, if you remember, we stayed at the airs and we had a, an attempted break in. If you've been following us, it did spook some of the others. It so did, yeah. This year we've took everybody's <coughs> um, needs into consideration as much as we can, and that's what we'll do. Um, and they felt happier to stay on site. So. For their sake, we're going to do that. It doesn't mean we'll never do airs again. We did airs coming back. We, we did, yeah. We don't have a problem with it, yeah. even though it was us that had the attempt to break it. Yeah. They didn't know what was lurking inside. Well, what I'm going to say is, it, okay, it's going to take us off the motorways into smaller roads, but I am going to get one of these truck sat-navs, which are on eBay and everyone 35 keeps, quid. 35, 40 quid, and everyone rants about, so, so I'm going to give it a go. If anyone wants to buy a Garmin sat-nav... Lifetime updates, or right, for a car. But it's rubbish. It's no good for a caravan. No, no. Just get the truck one. But I must say, it did get us through France and Spain, so it can't be that bad. Yeah, but it was stressful because we never knew if it was going to go wrong. All right, we'll do that in another vlog. Yes. We've already done that, haven't we? <laughs> so, we're going Cherbourg Pool, Mont Saint Michel. We're going to have a nosy round there. Visit Orador Sir Glen. Then we're going on to Carcassonne, Bay of Roses, Girona. And we hope to end up in Elch. Elch. But we can't book any sites. Via Mahaka. We are going to Mahaka oh, as yes, well. Oh yes, we are going to Mahaka. We're not yeah. sure what we're doing after that. Dependent on a something at the end of October, which we're waiting to hear about, aren't yeah, we? we are. So, I hope you're going to join us. That was a little update of what we're doing. We're really, really excited. We've only got 20 weeks left at Woodlands, haven't we? We have, yes. Well, 20 weeks left of work before we have our lovely endless summer mm. in Spain. Um, thanks for everybody who contributed yesterday on Facebook. I did put a big shout out to get some ideas, anybody new anywhere in France which is worth a visit. Please do still let us know if you've been somewhere that you think we should visit and well worth must see. And do pop it down below. We've had a lot of uh, people who have asked us, and we get it all the time, you know, we're doing this because of you, you've inspired us, but also people that want to start their own YouTube. And, and what do we say to that? Just go and do it. Just do it, because yeah. do you know what? We hadn't got, I didn't, like I say, we didn't really know what YouTube yeah. was. Well, I didn't. It we, opens up a lot of opportunities as well. You meet people you would never meet. You're, they all take an interest of what we're doing, and they sort of got the same lifestyle, haven't they? Yeah. Similar lifestyles. And also, we even have invites to stay at people's houses in yes, France. Yes, thank you so much to a gentleman who lives in um, Bourg it, it, Bergerac. Bergerac, yeah. And of course, Gay and Hobby, who's invited us many times. We will come. I just can't We will. We will do it. We've got plenty of plans, plenty of adventures. Goodness knows how we're going to fit it all in. I know. I know. So, if you are thinking about doing a YouTube channel, there isn't that many of us about, and I must give a quick mention to Should I Stay or Should I Tow Now? Stuart, Rebecca and Blue, they're just starting out. They're a lovely couple from up north somewhere. Do go and have a look at their channel. Um, they're just starting out doing it. And I mean, at the end of the day, you just need to be able to chat, which I do. Which she's good at. And Mark's very good at technical stuff. We love Allegedly. caravan. You are. We <laughs> love caravanning, and um, well, that's about it, really. We're just two people with a camera and a caravan, really, that's aren't it. we? 
But my goodness, we've met lovely, lovely friends. Yeah. And so we will see you in part two. So don't go away. We'll try. How are we going to upload these at the same time? Yeah, we will. Don't worry. Yeah. Another thing I'd like to point out is we'd never, ever edited anything, never used any software. Mark might be a computer engineer, but that was for her. We do cut and paste some of it. So you'll never get professional with us. But no. Then Summer starts as well. Yeah, but She's then getting fed up. <laughs> but then that's what makes it more real life, isn't it? Yeah. Really? yeah. We haven't got it's a clue. Real. It's definitely real. So you don't need any skills at all. Just chat, isn't it? It is. So on that note, we're going to leave you.